Hello, I'm Regina McCann Hess, president of Forge Wealth Management, and welcome to our Women in Wealth series. Today, we're going to talk about Medicare. Why are we talking about Medicare again? Well, guess what? It's open enrollment season, and that lasts from October 15th through December 7th. So many people have uh, multiple questions about this topic. So I'm just going to kind of do a little refresher on it. And, you know, just to let you know, you are not the only one thinking that Medicare is confusing because it is. It has a ton of rules, has all sorts of different dates. It has inclusions, exclusions, and of course, exceptions. But for those who are 65 years of age or who meet certain qualifying conditions, it's essential to understand its key parts to maximize the benefits and the features. So let's start with how it's structured. Medicare includes four parts, A, B, C, and D. Parts A and B are called original Medicare. Now, part A covers hospital stays and part B covers the doctor's visits. In a little bit more detail, part A pays for the hospital stays and follow-up costs associated with those stays. Now, it also covers various outpatient medical services such as home health care and physical therapy. While as part B pays for doctor visits and other medical care administered on an outpatient basis. It also may include the cost of medical equipment, devices, and some of those tests that you have to take as well. Now, uh, people who are already on Medicare do realize that it does not pay for all of your medical costs. So if you elect original Medicare, now that's part A and B, you should still expect to pay out-of-pocket costs, including co-payments and deductibles. Additionally, prescription drugs, vision care, dental care, hearing services are not covered by uh, original Medicare. So you may wanna consider other options for covering those services. Now, for instance, you can purchase Medicare supplement insurance and a standalone Medicare Part D plan that helps pay for prescription drugs. Otherwise, you can purchase a Medicare Advantage plan, Part C. So Part C is called Medicare Advantage. It's an option offered by private insurance companies. Now, it generally provides all the coverage in original Medicare and also adds, usually, Part D prescription drug coverage, along with dental, vision, and hearing services. Now, while Part C covers many items not addressed in original Medicare, it may restrict your choice of medical providers and treatment options, so do be aware of that. Part D is a standalone prescription drug insurance. Most Part D plans require that you pay a premium and you must sign up for coverage at age 65 or else be subject to penalties if you sign up for it later. That's where we get into those original uh, dates and things like that. They become very important. Now, while original Medicare is the same across the United States, Part C and D plans vary according to state, region, and even county. So make sure you understand what's available where you reside to maximize your coverage and your benefits. Also, coverage costs, deductibles, premiums, co-pays, and co-insurance also vary by plan. So it's important that you confirm these prior to selecting a plan. Also, keep in mind that your choices aren't permanent. As your health care needs change, you can change your plan too at least once each year during open enrollment, which is right now, October 15th through December 7th. So of course, if you want more information, you could speak to your financial professional. You can also visit the Medicare website at medicare.gov. Thank you so much for joining me. Again, I'm Regina McCann Hess, president of Forge Wealth Management. You can find my information at our website, forgewealth.com. I am also on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube at Forge Wealth, and of course, LinkedIn at Regina McCann Hess. Go make it a great day.